got this uh, new barbell here. Fun to squat with up in the Hollywood Hills. But you know what's more important than this barbell? Knowledge. And I know that my forearms are small and my abs are underdeveloped. So we're gonna fix that today. Back in the garage gym for another workout and we're not hitting calves today because I recently found out that my calves tape about an inch bigger than my arms. And we all know for symmetry purposes, I wanna let my arms catch up first. So once my arms catch back up to my calves, I'll start training my calves again. For today, it's forearms and abs. So I'm gonna start with forearms. We're gonna do some barbell work first, behind the back wrist curls. And then we're gonna do something different, maybe using the fat grips, just to kind of see how that feels. Then we'll move on to abs, where I'm gonna start with hanging leg raises. I don't really know what I'm gonna do after that. I was thinking about some vacuum work, just to work on my stomach control. That was something that I struggled a little bit with during the bodybuilding show. So I can always improve the ability to control my stomach. It's not gonna make a whole lot of difference now because I'm in a bulked state, but once those layers of fat start peeling off, it's gonna make a huge difference in how my physique looks, especially on stage. So let's go ahead and get started with forearms. Those feel pretty good. I think I'm gonna work up to a decent weight on these. Maybe something like, you know, 25 on each side. I'm not really sure. I'm already feeling a pump because I got my carbs in me this morning. So this may prove to be interesting. We got 115 pounds on here. This last set might be garbage, but honestly, I'm already feeling pretty good, so you may as well push the weight a little bit. I think I'm just gonna do one more set of these. Move on to my second forearm exercise before we get into abs. Whew, the forearms are definitely feeling pumped. And right now, like I've said with a couple of the other body parts I've been working, I don't really need a lot of volume because I'm just now starting off in this program. So we're gonna kind of ramp up everything slowly instead of just throwing a bunch of volume at it right now. For our next exercise, I put fat grips on these 20 pound dumbbells here. So I think we're just gonna do some regular reverse curls with these, really getting a good squeeze at the top, trying to crank out as many reps as possible. I'm just gonna do like two more sets of these and then call it for forearms. And I don't know if you can see this very well in the lighting, but my forearms are super pumped. Uh, holy crap.
set of those. straps for these because I don't think my grip strength is up for it right now <laughs> but let's see how the abs feel squeeze I feel that everywhere I think the abs are gonna be fine with just two more sets of this and then some vacuum work at the end but what I'm really thinking about when I'm doing these is pulling my belly button back to my spine as much as I can you know because you can flex the abs multiple different ways I don't know if you all seen that TikTok video of the guy who can like choose his abs where like he'll flex one way then another then another well, that's what I'm going for here. I want to shoot for total control of my midsection. And that's something that the bodybuilding show definitely taught me that I do not have yet. You guys hear that? My wife's upstairs sweeping. Thank you, honey. So now that we're done with that, we're gonna go into some vacuums. Now there's a couple different ways you can approach the vacuum exercise. You can do it lying, standing, or prone. Lying being the easiest variation because gravity is actually helping you, and prone being the hardest because you're going against gravity. The goal with each of these is to pull your belly button back towards your spine as far as you can for as long as you can. I'm probably gonna start out pretty sucky on these just because I haven't done these in so long. So let's see how it feels on the easiest variation, lying. All right, so pulling this down. <sighs> okay, yeah, that's tough. That last one was like as close as I could get to 10 seconds without dying. And since I'm breathing out all of my air before each set, it makes it extremely difficult to hold. But if you're ever looking to compete on stage, this skill is a must for stomach control. <sighs> okay. All right. Just going to do one more here. <sighs> 
Oh yeah. Ooh, almost got a cramp on that last one. Okay, let's test to see what my vacuum is actually looking like without the shirt on. All right, a little physique check here. This lighting actually makes my abs look decent. I'm gonna try a vacuum from here. Let's see what it looks like. Okay, I'm not too dissatisfied with that. Still, obviously, have a lot of work to do. I'm trying to build everything up during this bulk so that by the time I cut, I'm just gonna look absolutely insane. Right now, definitely looking and feeling a little bit fluffy, but that's part of the process. And there's a little voice in my head every time I look in the mirror, every time I take my shirt off, that says, oh my gosh, you've taken it too far. You're too heavy. You've gained too much fat. Pull back now, start cutting. But if I did that, I would negate all the progress that I've made so far and all the progress that I'm going to make during this bulk. So for any of you listening who's in the middle of a bulk or just starting or whatever, trust the process. <laughs> it's gonna pay off in the end, I promise. And especially for us natties, it's a lot harder to stay lean while you're bulking. So you're gonna put on a little bit of fat. You just gotta get used to it. We're gonna get big, we're gonna hold our size for a while, do a little bit of a maintenance phase, and then when we cut, we're keeping all of it. All right, that's enough of my rant for today. Already tell my abs are gonna be sore and my forearms are still ridiculously pumped. So I think this has been an awesome workout. Thank you everyone so much for watching. Train hard today and God bless.